You know, we just had to have less hours because of all the heat in order to protect our staff and also the riders. We just have done fewer rides. So typically on a day like today, we would do 20 different groups going out, but we're only gonna have about six or seven today. We've been operating for four years and we've seen spikes in the heat like this, but this definitely, especially this early in June, it seems pretty atypical for us to have these kind of hot days. So we're, we're not doing any rides typically between noon and like 6 p.m. So that whole block in the middle of the day, we're just avoiding that and only doing rides in the morning and then late at night. Uh, just another activity that involved water, so that you know we knew we were going to get hot being outside, but also not too far away from some water. I would say it feels a lot hotter, but I mean I'm embracing it, I'm enjoying it. Uh, I'd rather have this than the rain, so get to be outside. Even doing it early in the morning and late at night, we're definitely, you can tell, they're coming off tired. And everybody just feels the heat, you know, the humidity, I think, in particular, especially if you're doing anything physical, like paddling a kayak, just even anything remotely strenuous on days like this, it's pretty exhausting.